Hey everyone, it's Alex with Lover Fighter Writer, and in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can create custom templates in Phrase. So uh, I'm in Phrase here in the Templates uh, tab in the left sidebar, and there's actually two different types of templates that you can create in Phrase. You can create what they call manual templates, and you can create AI templates. Uh, now, manual templates are basically just uh, a predetermined type of outline um, like I have one for product reviews and it's basically just the general framework of how I like to write my product reviews but the AI templates are a little bit more interesting because they allow you to provide the AI with samples of writing and then you can just create a template where with the click of a button the AI will write you more content based on the samples that you provided so I'm going to show you how to create one of these, and then I'll show you exactly how they work. Now, there's actually two ways that you can create uh, a template. You can do it from here in the templates tab, or you can do it from within a document. So first, I'm going to show you how to do it uh, from the template tab here. Uh, so we're just going to go to new template, and you can select manual or AI. I'm going to select AI, and the template that I'm working on here is for organic Facebook posts. So I'm going to call it organic Facebook post and say create template. And now my examples go in here. I've already written these. So I'm just going to copy these and paste them in here. And so basically you want to make it very clear what each what's going on. So I, I've got service copywriting and then post content. So this is post content uh, about copywriting services, kind of organically marketing copywriting services. Then this one is service marketing for high ticket coaches. And this is a post about marketing for high ticket coaches, about uh, offering marketing for high ticket coaches as a service. Um, and then this is another one about copywriting. And then this one is about copywriting for marketing agencies. And so even though I've, uh, even though I've, these all kind of follow the theme of copywriting and marketing, I'll be able to use this template to generate posts for basically any kind of business. And you notice that there's three hashtags in between each example. That's important just to let the AI know that these are separate examples. And then down here, I've got uh, this part, which I just need to cut out of there and move over here into the prompt formula. So wherever you want the input uh, from the template, when you use the template, wherever you want the input to go, you put prompt with percentage signs on either side. And then here we just need to put in a quick description. So I'm just gonna say organic Facebook post generator. And then put in uh, input the service you provide or now you wish to market and then here I'm gonna put uh, web design and now I can test the template and you can modify the creativity uh, but usually I find that they work really well on low creativity so let's test this template All right, and so here we have a organic Facebook post about web design. It says, I've been designing websites for over 10 years now, and I've seen a lot of trends come and go. But one thing remains constant. People still love to read. That's why I decided to start writing. I wanted to share what I know with others who might benefit from it. So far, I've written two books on web design, and I'm look working on a third. If you'd like to learn more about my books, please visit my website at a URL. If you'd like to learn how to create better websites, check out my blog at, so this is an interesting post. Um, it's not exactly offering the service, but it could easily be modified to do so. Let's just test one more out. Maybe we will go with shoe shining. Throw it a little bit of a curveball and see what happens here. I'm looking for someone. Okay, that's uh, that didn't work well at all. Try it one more time. This is the thing about AI tools. Sometimes you need to give them multiple. Uh, tries. I've been doing this for years and I know it works. I can make your shoes look brand new again. And I don't just shine them, I buff them too. So if you're looking for a professional who will give your shoes a deep clean without breaking the bank, let's talk. There you go. 
perfect Facebook organic post uh, marketing shoe shining services. Um, so this actually auto saves, so I don't need to hit save or anything like that. Uh, I just need to finish it and I would say it's finished now. Um, so if I go back right here, uh, you can see now listed here in the all templates or in AI templates, I have organic Facebook post. And so now if I go into a document um, and I go to AI writer and AI templates, um, right here at the top are, uh, th there's a lot of uh, templates provided by phrase, but the ones at the top, the top three are ones that I created. Uh, so it, it automatically puts your custom templates at the top. And so now I can just open this and type in the name of a service such as um, professional clown services and run the template and it should write it right in here for me. Clowning around is fun, but when you're a professional clown, it's serious business. I've been working as a professional clown for more than 20 years, and I know what it takes to make people laugh. If you're looking for someone to who can make your event memorable, let's talk. There you go. It's got everything you need. It's got you know, a good hook. It's got a bit of information. It's got a call to action. So that is uh, how you create and use a custom template. And if you want, if you're ever in the middle of writing a document and you want to create one on the fly, then you just need to scroll down here and say new custom template. And that'll take you into the exact same builder that we saw before when we were over here. All right, uh, so I'll just really quickly show you. So if we go to new template again and manual template, then we could say, um, I'll just say information article, make it a generic template. And then we say create template. Uh, it literally just gives me this blank document, which again, auto saves. And I can create uh, whatever structure or framework that I want for an information article. And then, uh, so I'll just put a template here and then go back. And then, so now when I'm in a, a uh, document like this, I can also go to workflows and import template. And here are my templates. And so if I import uh, information article, then you can see it's gonna preview it right here. And I can say, use this template and it just imports it there and I can start working. All right, so that is uh, how to create and use custom frameworks or templates in a uh, phrase. I hope you find that helpful. Uh, let me know if you have any questions and I'll catch you in the next video.